I'm finished here. You're looking a lot better, that's for sure. Hey, we're getting a hollow call here. Someone named Moff Pyron. My lord, Moff Valiant Pyron. I've heard much about you. I thought it was time we spoke. I've been watching this conflict between you and Thanaton. I intend to be on the winning side. Then you intend to support me? I hope to. But I must be sure. You lack Imperial connection. But with the proper display of patriotism, you could easily win many of the Moths to your side. My loyalty to the Empire is unquestionable. It is my duty to serve. If only more Sith Lords thought like you. At Thanaton's behest, the Empire recently cut funding on a project called the Silencer. A super weapon capable of disintegrating an entire armada. If an ambitious young Sith were to see the weapon to completion and then test fire it on a Republic fleet, he would be well regarded. I'm guessing it takes more than sheer desire to complete this weapon. You're right. A special sensor chip, the CN-12, is required. The chip is only built on Nar Shaddaa. It's illegal in the Republic. In the Empire, it's... Well, we don't use it lightly. But I understand your little cult on Nar Shaddaa has moved into electronic weaponry and is now the chief supplier of these chips. I thought they were a bunch of lunatics who worshipped me. No one ever told me they were productive members of society. Perhaps it's time to see what your leadership has created. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have this business of the war to attend to. My lord, you've returned to us! My lord, the great healer. We'll tell Masters Riley and Destris you're here. We hope you'll be proud of the work we've done. Yes, my lord. We practically own the streets. My lord, good to see you again. Hope you like what we've done with the place. What can old Riley and Destris do for you? I'm here to reap the rewards of having my own cult. I need a chip called the CN-12. CN-12, huh? Funny you should mention it. We wanted to build your cult up into something big, see? And we picked the CN-12 to do it. It's a real crazy technology, and it just happened some of the members worked on an early prototype called the Death Mark. We saw an opening, and there you have it. It was all dandy until a mucker called the Veil got involved. He's blasted our supply chain to pieces, and he controls the CN-12 market now. Surely he'll be open to negotiations. He hasn't listened to a word so far. He's not easy to get at. Holes up in Shadow Town. And he made it clear he only wants to meet with the boss. We, uh, didn't think that was really an option. For the leader of this cult, I certainly am kept in the dark on a lot of things. I'm sorry, my lord. We won't let it happen again. Good luck. I am here as requested. Which one of you is the Veil? I am the Veil. No, I am the Veil. No, it is me. I am the Veil. Actually, none of us are the Veil. Because all of us are the Veil. Still, we are all very glad to make your acquaintance, Cult Master. I have a notorious reputation, especially when people steal from me. Ah, you speak of the CN-12. Everyone wants the CN-12. But few are willing to pay the price. The streets of Nar Shaddaa only have room for one true voice. 
Give us control of your cult, and we will give you the CN-12. You seem to have made a mistake. I'm not a naive thug like Destris or Riley. That is why we wanted to deal with you. The lowlifes that run your cult are brutal enough, but they lack vision. Why settle for a cult, when you can have an empire? Our resources extend beyond the CN-12. Armies need weapons, ships need engines. What does your cult provide you now? Donations? Artifacts? We offer that and more. Our reach extends across the galaxy. Simply send a signal from one of these devices, and our servants will come to your aid anywhere in the galaxy, not just on Nar Shaddaa. You will give me the CN-12, and you will serve me. We will give you the CN-12. We will serve you. Please, let us join your cult. I don't let people join for free. Of course, my lord. Here is the CN-12. We assure you, you will not regret this. My lord, how did the meeting with the Vale go? The Vale was three people, but I made them see reason. Three people? Who would have thought? Stick around as long as you like. The members are happy to have you here. My lord, thank you again. I, I was wondering, I mean, what was between us? I suppose I could linger a while if that's what you want. Well, um, yes. I mean, the place has gotten a lot nicer since you were last here. Stay as long as you like, my lord. We are always happy to have you among us. My lord, you're very efficient. I promised you my respect and support, but you have also gained my admiration. I trust you've heard the bad news. Darth Thanaton's superior on the Dark Council died mysteriously. Darth Thanaton has succeeded him. Then when I kill him, I will be a Dark Council member. Only if the Dark Council doesn't catch you. Isn't that how it works? I admire your determination, but I don't know how the other Moths will feel about opposing one of the galaxy's twelve most powerful Sith. Now, more than ever, the Silencer must be completed, and you must take the credit. The Moths must see the true future of the Sith Empire. Let me know when the weapon is completed. I will fire it myself. I will contact you when the weapon is ready for demonstration. Good luck, my lord. My lord, the Belsavis machine. It's made you better, but it wasn't enough to drive the voices from your head, was it? I can't take much more of this, truth be told. Zash is indisposed at the moment, but we still have the writings of Darth Vilas. We should go to Voss. Your body is cured, but Master Ryan always said, a Jedi's mind must be whole. It's the same for a Sith. You can't face Thanaton until you can control the dead you've found. We've arrived at the space station. From here, we can get transport to Voss. Let's figure out what we're doing. Voss? Who ever heard of such a place? You are going crazy. <laughs> I can't believe you think you can chase us away with some mythical healing ritual. You think you're the puppeteer, but you're just the puppet. I'll get you out of my skull, even if it means splitting it open and grabbing you myself. 
Sounds like things are getting worse up there. Hope we find this cure soon. You've been strong, but until you control these ghosts, they're of no use to you. I've been studying Darth Vilas's journals. It seems Vilas also found himself with unwanted tenants and came here to Vos for a cure. The sooner I can get these guys to shut up, the better. It won't be easy. Vilas failed and went insane. Vos is a recent and strange discovery. A utopia built around a group of Force users called Mystics. The Mystics aren't Sith or Jedi, though. For them, the Force is a conduit of healing and sometimes visions. Rituals that manipulate the Force are rare and often forbidden. It means the cure I'm looking for is likely also forbidden. If we're to believe Vilas' writings, yes. Doubtless, one of the Mystic Visions led to this ritual being... Stop! Ni Basai Kabarada Ayupapro Ni Magkasivan I was wondering when you'd show up again. After I'm healed, you're next, Ken. I promise. From Ibunao, Matida White. Don't say to talk to someone called Athelis Callus. Supposed to be researching the Voss. Guess we should start there. The revered mystic visionary Alarwan has seen your path. A vision says you will bring destruction to the Voss way of life. Turn back. You'll hardly notice I'm here, I assure you. Outsiders are often confused. We ask once more, leave Voss be. I am a lord of the Sith. You will have to do more than scold me. The revered mystic visionary Alarwan has seen that we must not use force to dissuade you. You will not destroy Voss. There are other means of persuasion. I've told you, Jofen, that the concept of diplomacy itself is strange to the Voss. As far as they are concerned, they are the only people who matter. They receive the visions, not the Empire. And not the Republic. And not the Republic. The point is, there's no precedent for what you're asking in Voss culture. Ah, my lord. Rural Jofen, Imperial Diplomatic Service. A pleasure. Try not to stir the pot too much while you're here. When the chips fall, we want the Voss to land with us. You understand, of course. I will be on my best behavior. I promise. Thank you, Mistress Callus. Again, my lord, a pleasure. My lord, good to see the rumors of your death are just that. But why Voss? Don't you have a Dark Council member to kill? With great power comes a lot of nagging, apparently. I'm listening. So you're after a healing ritual that can keep these, um, ghosts under your control. In all my time studying the Voss, I don't think I've ever encountered such a ritual. Although, let me look something up. I can't help but notice your complexion. I'm one of the few Sith-blooded Imperials with no Force sensitivity. But the Voss like color, so it's not a total loss. Let's see. Of the two kinds of mystics in Voss society, the visionaries and the healers, both are extremely rare. But rarer still is a small mystic subsect. Outcasts who call themselves the Dream Walkers. I understand, outsiders. We shall have a common ground. They spend most of their time meditating in an enclave below Voskar. Like all Vos, they're cagey around outsiders, but perhaps you can persuade them to help you. Greetings, friends. I seek a ritual to silence the ghosts in my mind. Can you help? An outsider? We get few visitors. You want the ritual of mind healing? It is hidden. Only our order know it. If you'll allow it, I'd like to join your order. You could join our order. It is not forbidden. Your mind is fragmented. You may not survive the initiation. If this is what it takes to learn the ritual, I embrace the risk. We are sorry if this kills you. Take this seed, burn it in the cavern, breathe its fumes, meditate, follow the dream. 
That is the first part. The second is a boon that you pay us. We choose when. I am indebted to you already, for your help. Dreamwalking binds your consciousness to ours. There is no choice. Here is the seed. Safe journey. My lord, you came back. I missed you so much. Why did you leave me? Why did you leave me oh. all alone? at all, did you? What's happening here? You are walking in a dream space, and where you go, we go. You have so many transgressions. This is going to be very fun. You are all that's dark and vile and impure in the galaxy. You used Rahana and deceived me. You are less than nothing. after my own heart. I was a Jedi once, full of spit and fire. For peace, of course. You did that one a favor. Give me control and I'll help you against the others. Tempting offer. But the point of this little exercise is to keep my sanity. Stubborn. Pity. We would have done great things together. You can't kill us, you know. We're part of you now. Apprentice! What have you done to me? You betrayed me! You ruined me! Kill your master, did you, Snake? I know just the punishment for you. You're free to leave any time. You will never be free of us. The Sith must obey tradition. Without it, the Empire would collapse. I love you like my own child, but you are a blight on the Sith Order and must be purged.
Fine, we relent, but only for now. You are not rid of us. You will never be rid of us. Your victory celebration is decidedly premature. Your determination only makes it more tragic. has ever returned to us. What you have seen is personal. We do not ask. You are one of us. You may enter our chambers in the Shrine of Healing. There you will find your ritual. Now, what do I owe you? I hate to leave any outstanding debts. Patience. When you reach the Shrine, present this insignia. You will learn the ritual of mind healing. We will collect the boon when we need. I won't let that happen. You cannot prevent it. May your journey lead to truth. Excuse me. I am looking for the Dreamwalker's chambers. You have passed the trials. You are not free to explore. The chambers are for Dreamwalkers. I'm a dreamwalker. Forgive me. Enjoy your research. Osada, this knowledge is forbidden. Who are you to forbid me? Marda, first dreamwalker and last. You seek the ritual of mind healing. It is forbidden. I sense your disease, the cost of desire. I will not help. Forbidden. Then you leave me no choice. It's a dream rock, and what does it do to nightmares? The dream rock is the dream rock. There is nothing like it. The nightmares are the disease. Defeat the nightmares, defeat the disease. A Gormak must go. A Gormak must use the dream rock. Gormaks seem to be everywhere. It shouldn't be hard to find one. Not just any Gormak. A Gormak that walks in dreams. The Gormak feeds the rock. The rock transforms the nightmares. The Voss kills the nightmares. The rock heals the Voss. The Gormak walk in their dreams. This is the Boo. It is still truth. It seems odd that a Gormak would be needed to heal a Voss. Their spirits are linked. One must heal the other. It is wrong. The Gormak are not Voss. Release me! Do you think I went through all that effort just to let you go? Don't be ridiculous. May the Voss crush you!
My lord, the boss are trying to force me off the planet. Their commandos are destroying my research. All because I helped you. I don't wish to cause any more trouble than necessary. Try to appease them until I get there. Thank you, my lord. But 20 years of my life! Get your hands off! You did not turn back. This is your second warning. Safe journey. Go away, and do not attack my servants again. Leave, and we will not attack. Thank you, my lord. What a mess. It looks like their bark was worse than their bite. They haven't broken much. Now, how's the ritual coming along? Have you discovered what you need to do? I spoke to a ghost in the Shrine of Healing, who told me I needed to find a Gormak. Tell me what you can. I've been studying the Voss for 20 years, and I think I understand two words. The Nightmare Lands, I understand. But you need to find a dreamwalking Gormak and activate a dream rock in order to fight nightmares? Don't forget the part where the nightmares turn to flesh and blood. Yes, of course. Look, I'm sorry, I, I can't wrap my head around this. A, a dreamwalking, nightmare-fighting Gormak. What would that be? A Gormak that can use the Force? I don't know what you're trying to do, let alone where to find one that can do it. Surely something like this must have come up in your research. My research is on Voss society, not on crazy ancient rituals given out by ghosts in hidden libraries. Here's what I can tell you. The Gormak hate the Voss, and they absolutely do not use the Force. <sighs> they refer to Voss mystics as nightmares, and the closest things they have to mystics socially are their shamans. End chapter, end book. What do you mean the shamans are like the mystics socially? Just that. They don't have the special abilities of the mystics, but they're sort of spiritual leaders. Wait, what's this? There is one obscure Gormak legend of a shaman who visited strange places in his sleep. It's a shot in the dark, but the shamans have a meeting stone deep in Gormak lands. Perhaps if you dream walk nearby, you may locate a fellow walker. I'm sorry I can't help you more, my lord. This force business is, no offense, insane. Yes, the man, I love you, the muck. Huavaska, bam, give the boom hound from one blow, the chow drop ya. I need your help to heal me. Then for you, the man, Achnan, chok, don't I? Ve begor, lesafun. Help me. Or I will tell your friends about your dream walking ability. We go away, Japan. Come on, we boy, hey, Triole. Nay, so fun, dear, go on the dog, Neva, hey, at Nanan, Nimatan. What kind of exchange did you have in mind? Go, Niko, why, bam, we chop I file, I am go, so nay, I am so. Huavaska, bam, give the bungham from one blow, the chow drop ya. Then for you, the dan, achnan, chok, don't I? They begor, nesafun. Why do the Voss try to stop you getting off the planet? Then for you, the dan, achnan, chok, don't I? They begor, nesafun. Gromniku, why? We have an agreement then. The ritual must take place in the Nightmare Lands. I'll meet you there. Man on one, whatever good meal on this war he. Huavaska, bam, give the bungham from one blow, the chow drop ya. Come try, kua vai dram nam, maya chong di to. Fran Viemoni, O Vabaka, Vihutroi, Kuatufunam. Nay, so fun, dear 
ko na to ni wa ay at tanan ni matan. I am supposed to go to the nightmare lands and use a rock. Why do the nang ko ka di lamat? Wa waska pam ki na kung kam trong wan lao the chao trok cha. I go wai na wai chapan. Kung di wai he triole. I will show you what to do. Don't worry about it. Kumniku wai bam nui chotai fai lai angor sun nei lam sayo. La tu si no fut kom ni go wa bon ge aroi. Kon ta sa vo fat ban kap. Well, hopefully this won't take too long. Nei so fun de ko na ta nei wa ei ak na nan ni matan. Ang ma, so yung sagor mo de na yan sum nata. My lord, Lord Joffrey here, Imperial Diplomatic Service. Natalis Kallis tells me you're working with the Gormak. Anything to stop them from shooting our people on sight, eh? You didn't call me just to congratulate me on my choice of allies. Ah, well. <laughs> Nothing gets by you, does it? When it comes to the Gormac, the Voss aren't very understanding. They wouldn't even allow us to keep one for research here on the station. The point is, be careful. When it comes to the Gormac, you never know. The Voss certainly are a strange people. You're telling me. But we'll have their allegiance by year's end, I think. Good luck, my lord. And thank you for your time. Wawaska, pam ki na kung kam trong wan plao the chao trok cha. I suspect it's important to the ritual. It wasn't visible outside the dream. Oh, kung kung sa ham bo ting na wan ni hao lei mai. You are using Voss powers to perform a Voss ritual. The crystal is no more corrupt than you. Wa ming guan guan kam ji wan guan ma. Boss, why are you here? I'm here for healing. I am Dalrin. I am the teacher of the rock. I go away. Teach me how to use this stone, honored one. We made the rock to ward off the nightmare. Healer, take the rock. Meditate. Transform the nightmare. Patient, defeat the nightmare. Use the rock. He uses the rock on the nightmares, and then I fight them, and then I take the rock and receive healing. Correct. Safe journey. Then for for that man, Achnan Chok Tontai, they begor Nesafun. When the nightmares appear, you use the dream rock. Then I kill them. Nangjuak, we come ropa la mid na kagamati. My lord, what are you doing? You can't do this to me. I love you. It's time for you to bleed, ghost. Use the dream rock, Gormak. your sense of humor. You won't beat me that easily. Yeah. <laughs> 
Sith, this is the end for you. You have no more tricks. Wait, what's happening? What are you doing? You still haven't come to terms with the wickedness of your ways, have you? So be it. You will die. How wonderful to see you again. I was just working on a new ritual. No, no, stop. What you can't do this to me again. Stop! Somehow always knew it would come to this. You and me. May the worms eat you. May your name vanish from all record. May your children die in their youth. This is it. Either this works, or I go insane. Are you all right? Are the ghosts still in your mind? They will not rebel against me again. I'm relieved, my lord. I hope you don't mind that I took the liberty of contacting the others on your ship. 
They've agreed to smuggle the Gormak through Voskha and up to the space station. If the Vos notice him, I don't think they'll approve. Dress him up. As you say, my lord. No Gormak may leave Vos. Control your people or leave, outsider. Please accept the Empire's sincere apologies. There must have been some misunderstanding. Is there anything wrong? Revered visionary Alarwan saw this. You have taken this creature off Voss. We can't allow this. The Voss reject your empire. Let's not lose our heads. I'm sure there's a rational explanation. Right, my lord? I don't see any Gormak here. You came here to help me. I don't see any Gormak here. Strange. Ah, I came here to help. Accept this gift as a sign of friendship. Safe journey. Unbelievable. How did you do that? It was nothing special. It was nothing special. Right, what was I thinking? Once again, it's been a pleasure. Good luck out there. My lord, your slaves are about to finish their final trial. You might want to be present for this. Thank you for telling me. You're welcome. This should be very interesting. My lord, you are just in time. The Acolytes should be returning shortly. There's something vaguely unsettling about Boneface. He's hardly said a word, but he's got a determined glint in his eye. Reminds me of you. Mogotoni ompi betwana, ni bobo, choba uma. Ah, there you are. My lord, it looks as if we were both wrong. May I present to you your apprentice? <clears throat> Maybe I wasn't so wrong after all. Ah, Boneface. So you're not dead, then? Zalek. Hmm? My name is Zalek. You're carving, my lord. Slave scum! Did you not listen to the rules of this academy? You do not murder another acolyte, and in the presence of witnesses! I'm sorry, my lord. It seems I've failed to teach this miserable dog a single lesson. I will let you know when a new shipment of slaves arrives. It's all right, Harkham. I like his style. He murdered an acolyte in the academy walls in the presence of an overseer and a lord of the Sith. To top it off, he's a slave! Sith tradition demands he be executed. Your defiance is foolish and misplaced. I'm only telling the truth. I put up with a lot around here, training low slaves into Sith Lords. But if the rules of subterfuge and skill give way to blind murder, then the whole Empire is doomed. Zalek completed his trials fairly. Give him your lightsaber. Zalek completed his trials fairly. I will give him my lightsaber. Congratulations, Zalek. Improbably, you have earned the right to become Sith. Take my lightsaber. My lord. I think you'll fit in well with my crew. Mm.